Just quickly, an introduction to how planes work. The textbooks, most of them have it wrong. They say, here's a wing. It's an airfoil shape that's cambered, something like so. That's low temperature, uh, low speed, forget about temperature. That's a low speed wing. A jet fighter looks something more like that with a really narrow wing. Because the faster it goes, the, this thing would generate that much lift if it was travelling um, supersonic speeds that the wings would actually lift themselves up and fold in half. And I wouldn't want to be the pilot in that one. So high speed wings generate less lift at a given speed than low speed wings. Yeah? So there is a function of wing shape, but the textbooks, as I said, most of your textbooks have it wrong. Most of your textbooks say this is what's happening. I have got air coming in towards a wing. Like so. It said, they say, this distance from there to there is smaller than this distance. As I said, this is wrong. But that's what the textbook says. Because over the top it has to travel further, it travels faster. There's this guy called Bernoulli. Welcome to the 1700s. Bernoulli, actually. French. God called Bernoulli, and he had a theorem. And it's basically pressure times velocity is a constant. So, the theory says, Jace, and it's wrong, that's faster. Because that's faster. That's lower pressure. Because that's slower. That's higher pressure. 